Hi, my name is Abigail Ladd and I am a first grade teacher. I think the training is super beneficial for all relationships and when it comes to teaching, it's all about relationships. My students won't learn well if they don't feel like they belong, if they don't feel like someone cares about them, if they think they're broken or they can't learn, which is huge, and they get labeled with things. And being able to be in that space of looking at them and saying like, no, no, you're cool. Like, I know you're not broken. You're fine. Like, you're just working at this. Not a big deal. Um, it's a, a really beautiful practice ground for me and myself. Like, I get to practice in where the stakes aren't too high. I'm practicing on these kids. And it's really easy to manifest that kind of change and to see it. And then I get to go like, oh, why can't I talk to myself like I would my student? And it's been a really nice kind of training ground for um, utilizing the tools I've learned in this training. I think that the training has prepared me to become a coach because it has taught me how to be myself, enjoy that, and know that that will take me where I want to go. That having faith and confidence in myself and in my skills is going to take me wherever I need to go. Um, and I think that's invaluable. I don't think a lot of programs can give you that kind of completeness that I got from this training. I think a lot of the time they want you to keep coming back and, and so they want you to be a little bit incomplete, like you're not quite there yet, whereas this one is like, take what you need and go use it your way. And I think that's awesome. I think this training really makes it easy for you to be a student. Uh, the online portion is really easy to navigate, but also just the support systems put in place by the staff, by the institute, to help you through if like something came up. Um, I like am voracious when I start programs, and I just went insane. But my peer coach, you know, she had some hard times meeting some of the schedules and being able to see how they accommodated her and how they worked with her to really help her you know, helped her succeed and, and really got her through. And I, I think that looking at our two experiences and having that um, showed me that they really want you to, to be a great student and to succeed. And, and they make it really easy uh, for you to dive as deep as you want, uh, you know, or study at your rate. Um, and I think that that's key to, you know, letting people Ex be exposed to, especially this type of material, um, letting them kind of like move through it as they need to. Um, so I think that they made it really, really easy to do that. The community is really positive for the training and, and there's an online Facebook group which is really helpful, but I also think that um, people just constantly reaching out. Like I connected with a woman on Facebook and then we started calling and it's really helpful as you digest and process everything you're learning and um, kind of that like think pair share as we call it in education where like you think about it and then you partner with someone and you kind of share your thoughts and you're like oh I didn't think about it from that point of view and you get a wider perspective um, than just your own. I've been constrained by all the like shoulds of life. I'm very much a rule follower and like oh I should do this and I should do that and and my relationship with food is obviously a part of that and it's allowed me to be like oh, there's no shoulds like people get to do what they want and they get to be who they want and you know giving everyone that permission to let go and and feel you know what the way they want to feel and be who they want to be is I think it's super empowering to me personally and, and has definitely, I can't go back. Once you know something, you can't unknow it. And, and I won't go back to what it was before because even if the behavior crops up again, I know now like what that's stemming from. And yeah, that's, 